Welcome back to my channel, Saving with Christina. So many important things to talk about this morning. Stay with me, you're not gonna regret it. Now, this is my Walgreens haul. I'm gonna walk you through everything I got at Walgreens this morning, lots of good food deals. There are a couple different promo codes that I used with my curbside order, so I'll tell you about that. I'll have clearance pictures at the end of the video. I'm also gonna be announcing the winner of the $50 gift card giveaway, telling you about some other giveaways I'm doing as well as um, a couple of really good holiday gift ideas. So like I said, a lot this morning in this first part, but stay with me. I know the video is getting out a little bit later than normal. I'm not feeling great, so I slept in a little bit. Um, Plus it's cold outside and it's just harder to wake up when it's cold outside. Um, the winner of the $50 gift card. So back up just a step. I will never comment and tell you that you've won, ever. I will always announce the winner of my giveaway in a video just like this. So I know there was a scammer that was commenting on people's comments and trying to get you to give them information. I can't control that. A lot of times they block me so that I can't see the comment and then delete them. As soon as I see it and I'm able to, I will delete it or I'll have a friend of mine go in who can see it and delete it. So I apologize that that happened. I just, I don't have control over it. So know that I will never comment the winner. Um, I will always announce it in the video like I'm doing right now, and then I will have the winner contact me so that I can get you um, the prize that you won. So the winner for the $50 gift card is Jay Hurtado. So if you can send me an email at savingwithchristina at outlook.com, um, I also want you to drop a comment, Jay Hurtado. That way I know it's you emailing me, um, letting me know that you won, and I will get you set up with that $50 gift card. Now, I am also running a giveaway on my second Instagram page. That Instagram is at Adventures with Christina. I'll pop it up here on the screen. I'm doing a giveaway of two pogo passes, and those are super fun. I'm going to tell you about those here in just a second. So definitely pop on over to Instagram to get entered. I will be doing another giveaway on um, YouTube this week, so stay tuned for that. Now, holiday gift ideas. Let's go ahead and talk about that pogo pass. So I just got the pogo pass, which has um, a number of different locations. This makes a great gift. If you know people or you live in one of the cities that it is available in because you pay one price and it gets you into a bunch of different attractions and uh, I can get you 50% off. So use my code SWC50. I'm going to drop the link down below. Use the link. Use that code. It's going to get you 50% off on those passes. We started using them on Friday. I took my son to the um, aquarium and it was super simple. I already had the pass. I showed him the pass on my phone. It paid zero dollars when I was there um, because the pass worked beautifully just the way it's supposed to. I like to try those things out. That way I can tell you guys if something weird happens or if there's any like hidden charges or anything. So I did try it out. It worked beautifully. Check out the Pogo Pass if that's something that you think your family might be interested in. The second great holiday gift idea that I wanna tell you about, one of my personal favorites, um, back when COVID hit, right at the 2020 timeframe, I started getting different meal kits because we weren't going to the grocery store. It was so easy. I didn't have to think about what to cook for dinner. And my absolute favorite one that we did was Home Chef. Now, the price point was a little bit higher on that one, so I ended up canceling after a little bit, even though I absolutely loved their meals. I just didn't want to keep paying for it after the grocery stores opened back up and all of that. But, holy moly, they have an amazing deal right now. 75% off. Use my link down below. You'll get 75% off plus free shipping on that first box. And then the next two boxes are 60 percent off. So even if you just try it for a little bit, it's an amazing deal. So I'll drop that down below. Last deal, and I signed up for this last night. I have been watching this company for a while. 
And I finally did it because the Black Friday deal that they're running right now is incredible. Again, I'll drop my link below. It's for Fabletics. So they have leggings that are two for 24 and then 80% off everything. So I bought 10 items and so I went a little nuts but I just paid like over $100 <clears throat> for all 10 of those items. So at 10 bucks a piece, obviously I thought it was a great deal or I wouldn't have done it. Now it is a subscription um, and all of the details are right there on the website, um, but you can skip weeks whenever you want and you can cancel whenever you want. So I did just place my first order last night. Obviously the shipment hasn't come in yet. Um, but check it out. If you've done Fabletics before, let me know what you think down in the comments because I'm really curious. All right, I think that was everything that I was supposed to tell you. I'm looking because I have a cheat sheet before we talk about the deals. Now, last night, um, I was kid-free. So what do I do with my kid-free time? Um, I go to Walgreens because I'm that super cool. Now, I did just pop in for a minute. Uh, planning to just take some clearance pictures for you guys and do just a few deals that were valid last week that were still valid this week. But check out what I found. Holy cow, these huge packs of Insure, normally $27.99, marked down to $2.99. There's a $5 digital coupon when you purchase two. And so because the final cost is over the coupon amount, that coupon does come off. So $2.99 times two is $5.98 minus that $5 digital coupon. I paid 98 cents for both of them or just 49 cents a piece. And I did notice when I was in the other store this morning, they also had a marked down to $2.99. They were gone, um, but that was in multiple stores in my area. So definitely check out um, your stores and see if you can find that deal. Obviously that is in store only for the clearance price. Another in-store only deal this week with the Register Awards is on these Oral-B toothbrushes. These are the Bacteria Blast, $3 a piece. So that's $6 for two. Clip the $3 digital coupon. You'll pay $3 at the register. Get a $3 Register Reward back, making them both free. Now, what else did I do in-store? Oh, I so... Online was being super weird this morning. Like when I was trying to shop, the buy one, get one free wasn't pulling up. It is now. Um, but then this um, oatmeal also wasn't pulling up the correct price. So I did this one in store. It is tagged $3.99. I purchased it at $3.99. I actually used the $3 register reward from the Oral-B to purchase it. Um, and then you get $2 back on Ibotta, making it $1.99 for this 42 ounce canister of oatmeal, which is a great price. Now, the chips, they are buy one, get one free. All of the Lay's um, bigger bags like this are buy one, get one free. So they are $4.59 for two of them, or just $2.29 a piece. Not a bad price, something you could take to your Thanksgiving dinner as a snack if you want. I'm super excited about Thanksgiving, mostly because my mom does everything and I just get to show up. I gave her um, a can of cranberry sauce. Like that's how lame I am. I said, here mom, I got the cranberry sauce covered. So I'm excited for Thanksgiving with my family and so is my son. He was like, I can't wait for Gigi's green beans, which I think is cute and I know she'll love that. Okay, other chip deal. Now, Follow me on this. These Lay's right here are a dollar a piece, the Lay's stacks. I noticed I had a $3 off coupon that was attaching to these, but you have to buy five. Now, when I was shopping curbside, my store did not have five of these, okay? If your store has five, get five of these. That's the best deal. So I picked up three, which is what my store said they had. And then I picked up two of the next least expensive items, which were these at $1.79 each, okay? That $3 off five digital coupon came off. Again, curbside order. I also used the promo code TAKE25 that took off another 90 cents, leaving me to pay $2.68 for all five of those items or just 53 cents each. Great deal on that. Now, 
more food. Y'all know I love a food deal. Gatorade Protein Zero. Now this is a Fetch Rewards deal. So if you don't have Fetch yet, grab it with my referral code because you'll score an additional $2 when you scan that first receipt. These are two for $14. I picked up two packs of the Gatorade Protein Zero uh, at $14 and that is what I paid. So it's a little bit higher out of pocket. But then I got back $9 on Fetch Rewards. I had two different Gatorade offers. One for $3 back with a limit of two, so I got $6 back there, and one for $3 back, so I got another $3. Making my final cost $5 for both, or $2.50 per four pack. And I think these are like a dollar, I'm gonna guess here, $1.38 each at Walmart. So great price if you like that Gatorade product. Now, the Dawn Power Wash. I know you guys love this Dawn Power Wash. It is $5.99. We're not gonna pay that. There is a $2.25 digital coupon. Use that code TAKE25 for a curbside order. It's gonna take off 94 cents, leaving you to pay $2.80 for this item. Now, Makeup, lots of free makeup. The Alme, this Alme um, Skin Perfecting Biome. It is on clearance for $4.49. I noticed I had a $5 digital coupon. It's gonna work for curbside. Um, if your coupon amount, like $5, is higher than the price of an item, it will work curbside. It will not work in store, okay? It won't come off in store. So I got this for free with a curbside order. Now, the Alme Mascara, this one is $2.49. There's a $3 digital, making it free. Just a heads up, if you buy them together, they're on promotion, buy one, get one 50% off, so the coupons aren't gonna take off the total amount, so you'll end up paying a little bit more than if you did them in separate transactions. Just a little tip. Now, this CoverGirl Clean Fresh, almost bought it last week, but I didn't, $6.99. There is a $3 digital coupon. I paid $3.99. I got back $4 on Ibotta, making it completely free. Now, I did. this is one of the ones I did last night before the um, Take 25 coupon popped up, so I'm not sure if that would attach to this or not, but you could always try it. Uh, if the Take 25 coupon doesn't work for you, try the coupon code FAST. 10 and no there's no way to use those on in-store purchases it's only for curbside now this wet and wild a dollar 79 for the blush a dollar 25 digital coupon paying just 54 cents again i did this last night now the dial i bought the foaming hand wash like the original like kit last week i bought the refill this time it's 5.99 there's a two dollar digital coupon Use the code TAKE25. It's going to take another dollar off. You'll pay $2.99. Getting back $1.50 on Ibotta. Also getting back $1.88 on the Shopkick app, making it completely free and a $0.39 cent moneymaker. Brand new to Shopkick. You can actually score $5. When you get the app completely free, use my code SWC5. You'll score an additional $5 back on that first purchase. Now, did I tell you about everything? There are more deals at Walgreens this week, but I was trying to hurry because I knew I had woken up late um, and I wanted to get the video out as soon as possible. And CVS has 90% off Halloween. So I ran there real quick to take some pictures to post over on Instagram. So lots of great deals at Walgreens this week. If y'all have questions, drop them down below. Of course, if you see other amazing deals, drop them in the comments because we all benefit from that. I think that was everything that I had for you guys. So hope you have a lovely Thanksgiving holiday. If I don't get a chance to talk with you guys via video before then, I am planning to do CVS. I just haven't sat down to write it up yet. Not sure about Walmart and Target. I have not made that decision yet. My son is home from school this week. It's Thanksgiving week. So y'all are just going to have to wait and see on that Walmart Target video for the week. Thanks.